My mom was mad because the past two interviews or whatever I had, I, my hair was like down. She said it looked like Last of the Mohicans, you know, kind of Indianish. So she told me I had to spike it up. So I had to spike it up for you today. Did you tell her or did you just walk through the front door? I well, I sent her a, a picture of uh, of my mohawk after I shaved it before the Florida game that night, Friday night, and she goes, "Yuck!" That's all she said. She was mad. I talked to her after the game. She said that uh, she said she hated it and she couldn't believe that I did it. But then then I came down the ball. I had it spiked up. And she said she kind of liked it, but she's still wanting me. She's counting down the days for me to shave it. My dad, he didn't really care. He's just whatever you got to do, do it. My grand, my grandfather. My 80-year-old grandfather on my mom's side, he came down for the Florida game, and uh, he hated it. He's old school now. You know, he played no face mask back in the day. He had the swoop over and everything, so he wasn't all about it. So what inspired that, and what, what will uh, eventually end it? Uh, <laughs> I'm telling you, now y'all saw my hair right before I did it. It's kind of long. It was just too soft too soft. I can't have that long hair, you know. I've been shaving my head for like nine years now and felt like that was kind of tough and mean and so I had to do something different. I had to, it's my senior year, why not do a little mohawk? So I don't, I don't know how long it's going to stay. I asked Coach Dooley the other day because I thought he was mad at me when I first did it because he looked at me, he's kind of like, mm. you know, like, I don't know what he thought. And I asked him after the game, I was like, Coach, what do you think of the mohawk? And he's like, hey, you know what, you're playing well, keep it. And I was like, well, I'm not superstitious, Coach, so if I got a bad game or whatever, I'm still probably going to keep it. I don't know. <laughs> coach said he was telling us about because he's always got the perfect hair. You know, he's got that swoop over. Uh, <laughs> he said that he's trained his hair for like 20 years or something like that. He's had the same cut since he's like 12 years old. So he said there's no way that thing's changing. But uh, I'm trying to get Coach Wilcox, so stay tuned for that one. you realize you spent the last five minutes talking about the hair? Yeah, this is probably a lot of wasted tape and film. Sorry, guys. <laughs>